people of not so very okay Ooh. so let me give y'all the rundown of what has been going on Let me fix this thing real quick. I need to fix the value, y'all, because it is just. Too freaking low. Okay, let me see if it's still ugly in the back. No. Okay, let's fix. <clears throat> so let's give you the rundown of what's been going on. So Yasmin is freaking pregnant. Okay. Um, I've recorded like a whole two sim days when I first got her to take the pregnancy test. But since her and Eric, so she found that Eric was about to like kick the bucket or whatever she has been in, they've been humping like rabbits around here so this pregnancy just like the last pregnancy that she had i was not with it um but i said you know whatever you know eric is about to go and she's pregnant so whatever but these is two unplanned pregnancies blaze was unplanned and whatever this baby is is going to be unplanned too I didn't even look to see what it was because it's just going to be a surprise. Um, Eric is still alive. Yeah, Eric is still alive. Um, even though when you go to him, it say that he almost about to go. So I don't know. He's still alive. He's been alive for the past two days. So it's Tuesday. So... When I last recorded, it was the weekend, so we was doing, like, everything with them, like, um, what was we doing with them? We were just doing a lot with them or whatever, but then I recorded the episode after that, but it didn't save or whatever, so that's where we at right now. That's when I found out she was pregnant. Um, Blaze aged up into a teen, and, um, look at him, he is just so handsome, literally. <laughs> He's doing his project right now. But he is so handsome. And I moved his room into uh, the boys' old room. So this is what the room looked like, except for I just put, like, kid posters on there, which I probably shouldn't take it out. Oh, it was like this when he was a kid, and then I had made this the bathroom or whatever. And I didn't do nothing fancy to Marigold's room. Just put a bed in there for her. So she could sleep because they have their own house that I just built for them. And I just stuck, I finished decorating her bedroom because I realized that she's going to be a teenager when we move into that house. So, um, yeah, so she has, So she has one more day into her birthday and then she'll be a teenager. So I think her birthday is like tomorrow, same day or whatever. But we need her to go to sleep because I don't know what she's doing up. Um, Cherry, why are you woke? Why is everybody so sad? Oh, because Lady ran away. She always running away. Hey, girl. There's something going on. up? Oh, yeah, Charlie is still a young adult. Okay. I was just checking to see what the heck was going on. Okay, yeah, so she's still a young adult. So she still got a lot of time left before she become an adult. Um, but does she have to go to work or something? That's why she... She up. And Yasmin, she was supposed to age up, but she didn't. Now she has two days left to age up because she's pregnant with Eric's baby. Um, oh, and we brought Bruce back. And, of course, we brought Bruce back before we found out that she was pregnant because I was going to get Lady and Bruce to have a puppy. But Lord knows we can't do that now because she's having a baby. Like, she always knows something 
to mess with somebody's plans. But Bruce is back, and we got him to age down treat. So we just got those things from the um, the vet clinic and the vending machine that like reincarnate the pets and age them down. So now they both adults. So they just like getting to know each other or whatever. You should have seen it. It was so cute. Lady was kissing all on first. Like she was so happy to have him back in here. Um, what else? I mean, that's all that pretty much that went on in here. I mean. Yeah, so Blaze got some skills, some like programming skills or whatever. He got a couple of skills that he has. Um, Cherry got a promotion. Okay, let me go to Cherry. So Cherry got a promotion. Um, I don't think I see it up here. And she is now a what is it? A council council person. Okay. And she worked five days, so this job was pretty easy to get through. Like working from home and doing it, but uh, I'm saying that now, but it's probably not gonna be easy a little bit later on the track. And then Yasmin also got a promotion and she is a pioneer of the new technology. So she should be I think that's like she had like two more promotions and this should be she'll be done um her generation will definitely be done and then we can move out um cherry and marigold into their new place that i built for them and yeah so let's go ahead and play i don't know what's going on everybody is looking at crazy me <coughs> Okay, you can go back to sleep. You don't have to be up anymore. And Marigold is still sad because her grandpa had passed away on her dad's side. Um, and in a, the episode that I thought that I recorded, but it didn't. The episode that didn't see that, that I recorded. Um, Cherry had went out with Evie and took her out from the town. They had a carnival, I mean a festival or something, and they went to the festival. And um, where did he think he going? And you didn't even finish your project. He tired. Yeah, he about to fall out. And right, go to sleep. Everybody know how to sleep now. But um, she had took Evie out to the carnival or whatever to cheer her up. Because her dad died, you know, and um, we haven't heard anything from Pierce. Pierce, I think he didn't even show up. Evie was the only one that came third. Evie and Courtney. Okay, so it's two in the morning. Let's slow down time. Um, oh my goodness, I did not miss having you back in here if you want to make all that dang noise, boy. Cut it out. Okay, let's see what you have in with her rest. So she's pretty good. Um, she's pregnant. Okay, <laughs> so good. Come and take a shower. Like, get up right now and do it. Eric is gonna get up and he's not really all that hungry, but I'm gonna ask him to get up and um, make some oatmeal. Okay, Cherry, let's see what she gotta do. She's okay, she can sleep for a little while. Come in here. And, um, 
take my shower. Okay. So what do you have to do for your dog? Um, okay, so we have to secure two more votes and then we have to chat or give a speech in Upton. Okay. So I clicked on work from home from her, but I really didn't mean to. Um, and then when she get out, I wanted to cook some breakfast for everybody. Mm. I really am going to miss a house, though. This house is like... Too cute. Okay, um, but I just did Marigold's room. Her room is like really cute. We can make some pancakes for the family. Um, call them the sides, of course. Cause you got a big family here. Yeah. Let's see what, um, I thought you was going to sleep. Why are you still up? Uh, I'm asleep. I'm sitting up watching TV. Trey, you better fix this damn thing. Knock this stuff up. Maybe you can get on a computer and chat with that boy again that we've seen. <laughs> So you can build up your relationship. Um, which one is he? Oh, him right here. Dwayne. I don't know why she's crying in her sleep. Oh, she's still sad about her dad, her granddad. She never even met that guy. Girl, stop being so sad about somebody you never even met. Okay, Eric, um, let's see, use the bathroom. Is he eating his oatmeal? Probably. Um, use the toilet, and then I kind of want to work on. Um, his logic skill. Try to get a logic skill up to a level 10. And he's at a level 9. He has me clean up the spoiled food in here. Just sit the dang plate down, girl. Thing. Y'all be taking forever to do a lot. Look at how pregnant she is, though. 
Like she has second trimester. Yeah, second trimester. She'll be in her third trimester in three hours. So that means they can see that like six or seven o'clock in the morning. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, come down and grab a serving of food. It's six o'clock, so you guys will wake up. The kids. Let them get themselves ready and grab something to eat. Because they do have school. Okay, girl, come use the toilet. Take a shower, brush your teeth. Get up. And come get some pancakes. You about to get up too. Uh -huh. Come grab some pancakes, thank you. Before you have to go to school in the morning. Hmm. I like your little outfit today. So cute. Um. Okay. Lady is back home. I am the filthy. Can you give her a bath after you finish eating, Charlie? Uh, please. Zoe B. Denaya. Sneed. Give her a bath. But how would you give her a bath with that plate in your hand? Okay, good thing you smart enough to put it down. Alright. Let's see, how is Eric feeling? Okay, he's about to go to work in an hour. He's okay. I'll just let him continue to work on his logic skill until he gets home. Homework. Oh, yes, man. I'm going to send her to work. So I can't do nothing with her while she's pregnant. Like, nothing. But she need to come use the bathroom and um I mean, she could just sit down and watch TV or something. Okay. These two are about to go to school. <laughs> I'm about to say, I thought you had the responsible trait. Don't be forgetting about your traits now. Your grandma, your mama raised you right. Okay, girl, um, what do you, can you do for now? You just need to go have some fun until it's time to go to school. Go and play with some toys. Uh, 
Oh, it's time for you to go to school. Okay. Okay. Eric, it's time for you to go to work as well. Ah, in the Let's see if, um, yes, and I mean, Cherry, okay. So I guess Cherry isn't going to work today. Hold on, let me see her work schedule. Oh, so she does go to work today at 8 o'clock. But why she ain't go? Is she working from home or go to work? I mean, we could have stayed home with you and you did this, but it's okay. Just go to work. Okay. And last but not least, yes, man, where is she? You fucking watching TV. You talk to birds. Who's calling? Sick with worry. Um, take these words. Who else is calling? <laughs> Mergle, somebody took Mergle stuff. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Your grandma ain't gonna tell you to punch these people. Go to work. Yeah, man. Bye. She'll prank yourself. I will go with you, but you're pregnant and I can't. A new challenge. Um, present suggestions or demand a change. Um, present suggestions. Because you don't want to seem like you're overbearing to your boss, right? So she got a medium performance game. Yes, Yasmin is now at work. Okay, great. Dogs is barking off the hook. Like, you don't have no common sense. That's Bruce. The house was quiet when you was in the grave. Just me. Now you want to bark at your own tail. So now we're just waiting for them to come back home from work and stuff. The kids should be coming home first. We should be going home in the next hour. Oh, yes, we're just going through it at work right now. She is going through it at work. She is tense like it ain't nothing. Okay, the kids are home. All right, um... Let's see, so how did Maryville's work day go? I mean, work day, school day. I keep saying work for her. How did her school day go? Look, she is so cute. Look at her outfit. Okay, let's see what happened at school. Okay, so she had a good school day, yeah, but I think it's like dirty or something where she was, so she can get all that. Um, 
kind of decided to do my homework. Hopefully she's not too tense. And Reese, I don't know if he's tired, but he gotta do his homework too. Oh, he's too tired. Okay, can you work on your project? Do something productive with your life. So we have them going ahead and doing some stuff. And now we're just waiting for Eric to come home and Eric and um, Cherry will be home next and then last Yasmin. Let me see, when she finished doing her homework, I want her to turn on. She is kind of tired, but go use the toilet and then you can come over here and watch TV for a little while. And when you finish, I need you to come upstairs. You can use the toilet. And then you can go to sleep. Okay, yep, Eric and Cherry is back. So let's see. Look at Cherry outfit. She always fought and look at this. Girl, and she fought in the music note. Like when she fought in songs now. I can't deal with her in this fight, you know. She was doing this since she was a kid and her dad is always saying, Stop fighting. Don't fight. And she still do it. Like, Dad, tell her something. Love this sweet. She still does it. Like, it's so annoying. Y'all remember when Charlie was little? Our dad used to be always talking to her. Like, what is you doing on that fucking boy? She had a parent present. Give her a chair a present. Charlie, you gonna pay the chair up? Um, and. Oh, they can become best friends. That's cute. Let's do it. Um, become best friends with your dad. <sighs> Even though you ain't listened to nothing he said when he was younger. He told you. Okay. So let's have him come over here and work on his business stuff. Um... First, let's have him invest in the stock. We always want to invest 5000 And then let's have him work on his web stuff. Research stocks. Okay. And then Cherry can... Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to go to sleep. Oh, okay, you finished your project. Great. Up, you can just do your homework. Hmm. Okay, Marco, she's kind of tired. I'm gonna come in and get some leftovers and then she can go to sleep.
Так, начинается лава. Я типа best friends. Okay, yeah, Charlie's about to pass the freak out. She's like, oh, I don't know where. Okay, but I just buy something to do. Mm. to stand out to sleep, but I really don't know how to go to sleep at night, but like, they will have toys or something before, it's not fair to go to bed because it's still early, um, come on here and send me a swing set. Enjoy this nice cool breeze. Um, okay, Eric is working on his thing and then he can come and go to sleep. He got to sit there for now. His boy has to be broke. Okay. Um, Come here, I want him to get some food. Get some leftovers and then use the bathroom. Take a shower and then go to sleep. And Yasmin is home, she didn't get no promotion. But she is dumb tired. Okay, um, no, go to sleep in New York. And my daughter is now about to go to bed. Okay, she's like, I'm tired of playing outside. All right, um, Let's see what's going on with Yasmin. So, she was feeling insecure because she was away from Eric. She's in her third trimester. She likes the decorations and she's completely exhausted. Yeah. Eric, yeah, how long does it take you to do that? You almost done. Did that make your work performance go down? No. Alright, well, let's do everything else first. Because you're getting tired. And I still want you to get some food in the system. Cherry is about to wake up. And I feel like she had enough sleep. Come get some leftovers. Watch TV. I say eat first. What are you doing? I say come and eat first. And then go in here and watch TV. I want Eric to get the food, boy. He's really tired. But trust me, you're about to sleep soon enough. Just eat that food. Okay. Um.
by the way, kids, but uh, Blaze needs to get up. If they're in heat, I guess I'm fine. Or something, so you can come play the video game. Play multiplayer online game. Play with, um, oh, play with your brothers. Dang, so they moved into somebody's damn house because they got a damn TV and the game system. Hmm. I wonder why they was calling Eric and asking him that he want to come over their house. They was got a nice little house. Edward is calling us. You don't want to talk to Edward right now. You just chilling. Cherry, come and fill these bubbles. Okay, get up. Get up. Go pee. I need to make sure we don't miss Cherry's birthday. Serve dinner. What did she fix? I'm just tired of us eating the same stuff. Make some grilled cheese. Shit. Um. Can we go and ask our brother for a vote? Let's see. I don't know if we can get him to do it. Because he's a teenager, so I don't think we, teens can vote. <laughs> oh, vote for more policies. That's all we can do is promote policies. We can't ask him for his vote. Politician coming in. Okay. Okay, you can come online and socialize with that guy so we can build a good relationship with him so we can invite him out. And ask him to well, hopefully be one of our boyfriends. So did you win some money or something? Do your homework. Your mom is about to cook dinner. Maybe she got her butt up. It's twelve o'clock at night. Yes, man, it took a bunch of to be it. I don't know how to get up. Uh, okay. So we need to throw Cherry a birthday party today. Because, I mean, not Cherry, Marigold, because it is Marigold's birthday. So I don't know where we're going to go to have our birthday party day. Um, I might just take it out to a restaurant or whatever like that. Because we just go to restaurants now. <laughs> so we just take it out to a restaurant and throw her party there. I mean, she don't got no friends or nothing. So it's not like trying to spend a lot of money to have her party. Like we did when she was a toddler and it didn't work out right. Well, I could have it at that place when she was a toddler and just try and um 
I can make turn it into a restaurant. Actually, it came with a bar. I can turn it into a restaurant. And it means I'm gonna have to add all the restaurant stuff in there. Like build it on my own on another, I guess, in the building. I don't know, see, because I'm still gonna be on here, so I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but we'll figure it out. We might actually do it at that place. And make it a restaurant. Um, should I go try to do that now or wait? I'll wait until everybody is at work and stuff. But then I will do that and then when we get off of work, then we'll go ahead and have her party. Well, that's how we'll do it. Cherry. She just only has to get up here. Go ahead and take the shower. And go to sleep. Yes, come grab some food if your mom is cooked. You can even come watch TV or something. Um, Cherry, I mean, Yasmin. Okay, she's eating, and then I'm gonna send her right back to bed. After she use the bathroom, after she eats. Try, you broke your computer. Something I broke in here. What's broke? What's broken? Oh, it was raining outside. Uh, Okay, Margo is hungry. Make her get up. Come get some food, baby. Ooh, watch TV. Look at how pregnant she is. I can't. I wonder what this baby gonna be. A boy or a girl? I kind of want to see, but I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna let it be a surprise. Um. Come on, grab this food so I can put it away. I told you to watch TV. You want to sit right here? And eat. Thank you. Go sit but next to your uncle. And go watch TV. Let's check on Eric. He has to use the bathroom. I'm not making him walk all the way upstairs, so we have to wait for you guys to get up. <laughs> I feel like she's taking forever on the toilet. Marco, seriously.
Can you both can you eat your food? TV as well. Y'all gonna sit here and watch TV together. Uh, so Eric may be allowed to see his granddaughter become a teenager and to see his last and final baby boy. She's getting so excited right now. Did she do one more? Yes. Okay. And what is her grades like? She has an A in school, so she's a good student. Okay, Marigold, you got an A. And she has a responsibility trait, I think. Yes. And she has good manners. And she knows how to control herself. Okay. She's going to ask his dad for advice. After that, we sent him to the bed. Did you finish your homework, or did you even do your homework? Okay, you don't gotta do extra credit. We should agree. Like, you have a B, so you're okay. Just don't go to sleep. It's not like you're failing or anything. Okay. Um. Do a workout or talk it through with someone. How about you do a workout? Your dad will take you to a workout. He's like, go work it out, honey. Okay, um, I hate when I do this when I'm dragging plates and stuff. She asked him about eating dirt. Girl, you're about to be a teenager. Ain't you too old to be asking those questions? No, you can't eat no goddamn dirt. <laughs> this is so cute. Eric and his granddaughter. Oh. So cute. <laughs> Did he have a picture of Marigold as a um, child? Let me see. I hope so. Yeah, we do. Okay. Okay, yeah, we have a picture of her as a child. Okay, um, Eric. I can have him actually come finish doing his work assignment before he goes off to work. Um, but I kind of just want him to work on that logic skill, truthfully. 
He's 75% complete that thing, so it's not like, you know. Let's see, let's play on a logic table. And Marisol, um, she has to go use the bathroom and take a shower, so I'm going to have her go do that. Um... Hopefully you can get this logic skill up. Um, let's see. So how is Eric feeling right now? Okay, he is... He's not getting enough exercise, so he's feeling tense. Um, what else? Romantic sims need to show love. Okay. Pretty tasty food, and he's a masterful maneuver from this thing he's playing. Okay. Um, it's raining outside, actually. We need to make sure that Marigold has an umbrella. I don't think she does, and I don't think Blaze does either. Do you have an umbrella? He's gonna have to go grab one before he goes to school. Take an umbrella. What the hell did you do to the bathroom? Or use the toilet? Is the shower broke? You take a shower and then come downstairs and grab an umbrella because it's rain. Oh, the mostly because of the rain outside. That's what I hear. <laughs> no, the shower is broken. I don't know they have rain or the toilet or something. Okay, Cherry is about to go to work. Let's see who needs. She's okay. Um, so this is Marigold. So this one is great. We'll give her that one. Okay. So she has her umbrella. And now she's about to go to work. I'm going to school. It's a birthday. Eric is about to go to work. Go ahead, Eric. Please go to school. Yasmin is going into labor. Jeez. Come on, Marigold. Go to school, girl. You already got your umbrella, so. Do we even have a baby carriage? No. So we just gonna be waiting around until she has the baby. I mean, I can go, and we don't even have a room for this baby. Oh my goodness, that means I'm gonna have to make that bathroom a baby's room again. Ugh, it's annoying. Like, nobody told you to have no more kids. We was fine with the kids that we had. Jeez, you have me? Why 
Why is she going to school? Go to school. All right, so everybody should be out the house. Where is Blaze? Why is he? Why are you not going to school? You already got an umbrella. Go to school, boy. Yeah, he late. I don't know because he came back with an umbrella. It's not even that bad of rain out there. It's just a little drizzle. And Yasmin, uh, I don't know if I should go to the hospital with her. I don't even... I don't even feel like going to no hospital. Let's see. I'm gonna have her come in here and finish eating. Eat this cake. I guess she's gonna take the day off of work because um and they don't need to go into work if you have a baby girl. Like, call work. Oh, are we sending you to work? Uh, <laughs> go ahead, send our ass to work. Sure. Go to work. Oh, we just want to call out, but they just called, they called in really quickly. Um, so I guess I'll wait till she go to work and then. We'll go and try to edit this video for Cherry's birthday. So we about to have a birthday and a birth. Oh, I can't have you. You can't go to work. You need to um call out. Hold up. Yeah, you need to call out because you are so uncomfortable. Call the job and take a. Oh no, we ain't taking no goddamn family day. We gonna take a vacation day. You got enough stuff in it too. Yeah, you got like 15 days, girl. You gotta take some fucking vacation days. Because you're gonna be racking them up when it's time for you to get old. Oh, you boy. She's like, yeah, I'm not gonna be able to come in here today. I'm in so much freaking pain. Like, I can't do it. I just can't. Come over here and try to watch TV or something. Watch a movie um, or something. I don't know. But let's go and edit this video real quick while uh, we wait for her to have this baby. Um, just go manage for us. Y'all probably was like, I don't see how she be um, playing that game and that game be lagging like that. No, it was that program that I was using to record. I like this one that I use now. Oh, I do. I like this one now. But the only thing about this one is that you can see like when I start recording and when I start recording. So, because I don't have like an editor to like edit it or whatever. But once I get a good editor, y'all ain't going to be able to see all that. But I just need to find like the editing program that uh that works for me that's kind of easy or whatever. So I'm gonna go try and see if we can um if we can turn this place into a um the thing is though, I don't even want to go here like I don't want to go to that place. Um, let me see if I got anything in the library that I can put down. Thank you, let's see. 
see what we got. This is Maribel's bedroom, y'all. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. This little sneak peek of it. I just did it. Um, and I saved it because I'm gonna save, actually I'm gonna start saving like all my rooms, even though I do the whole houses. I'm gonna start saving all the rooms because the girls, they don't really like to build. Um, this was the castle that they built actually. They did this together and it looks really, really good. Um, I did say I was going to do like a video on their stuff, but they make really good Sims. Like all these Sims, these are they Sims. All these people are they people. <laughs> um, they make a lot of Sims. Just one of my Sims, I think. This one of my Sims. I only got like, I only got a couple of save files. I, mean, I got like three. Maybe three save files. The rest of these Sims is their Sims. Um, that's Miracle. I mean, yeah, it's when she was younger. Live by herself. Um, to look, that's our family. These families be looking cute. But let me go and find a, a venue. That's what I was trying to do. Not find a sim. So we have this place. Oh, that's the one I just put down. Um, so we have this, but this is more for like. Uh, I think I'm gonna just probably place down in the restaurant and get our things in here. Cause I could build like a little venue or whatever, but technically, like the only people that's really gonna come is her family, like her dad, her mom, her grandparents, her aunt, and her uncle. Cause she don't have no damn friends. Because she can't have friends because, you know. So I think we're just going to get our restaurant. Uh, let me see what restaurants they got here. Because I could have turned that other place to a restaurant, but then it would have been too much deleting this and deleting it. Uh, let's go and try to see if I can edit it into a restaurant. Or whatever. I really don't feel like building anything new. <laughs> I'm not with it right now. I feel like I just did Marigold's whole room. And that was that took me like three hours just to furnish her room. Her, the house was already built. I've been built a house like two or three weeks ago. And I had to go through and edit the furniture because some of the furniture was glitching out like the sofa. So I had to put like other sofas in there that, that I thought looked nice. So yeah. And then I had to change some stuff around because I forgot I had put her computer on. I put that computer on the dining room table. Like, why the fuck I put this computer right here? Because they didn't have a computer desk <laughs> in the house. And then I didn't have a space inside of the um I didn't have no space inside of the living room, but then I figured it out, so. Yeah, but her house looked really nice. I like Cherry's new house. Um, I can't wait for you guys to see it. It's gonna be just an amazing house. So it's looking like the generations are overlapping each other because now we're about to have Marigold as a team and we're about to start working on her aspirations and stuff. Now that we can, since she's a teenager, well, since she's about to turn into a teen. Um, so I'm 
So I can can I change this to the restaurant? Um, let's see. Cafe bar. Museum nightclub park. Restaurant. Okay. I was changing into a restaurant, so I need some stuff. Okay. So what else do we need? We need okay, we got two sinks, we need a toilet, we got that. Um, chef, what? Chef station. And it's a dining spot, so we got enough of them. And we need a waiter station and a host station. Okay, so let's see, how can we get that in here? I don't know what that stuff is. I never even built a restaurant before, but about to try um so let's just move that out the way for a second um so really we need to be moving like these things off of this table so they can actually eat because i'm not sure if they can eat with all this stuff all over the place they probably can I'm not sure, um, but we need a waiter station and a chef station, so what is that? Um, community items, restaurant items. Okay. So let's go to chef station. That okay, this is a chef station here. Must place on a wall. All right. Um, okay, we can put that back. And I guess we can delete. Hold on, how big is the chef station? Okay. We can remove like some of these things. Sparkly lights. Okay, so we have this chef station, which fits. Is 
this a chef's kitchen? This is uncomfortable, and this one is uncomfortable too, but yeah. against the wall. All right, you know what? We're gonna get this one. Let's turn here. Do all that shit. Let's see what we got. All right, and then we can just copy these things back. Let's make it look that cute with them. Um, and let's copy Not the window. Please, not the fan window. Mm. I'm not sure if I need to give me some wallpaper or something. Okay, let's get the shelves. Put the shelves back. Okay, and let's get the little lights. Um, oh, it's white, the lights. They keep giving me the same. <laughs> I swear, they about to get smacked. Zip um, Come on, all this little damn child birthday. Come on now. It's a little girl birthday. I'm trying to get everything back the way it was. Okay, let's see. Outside double window. No. It's not the window I'm trying to get. It's this thing. Yes. Jeez. Now I see where it's at. Don't have to worry. Okay. Now let's get the um let's get some more pies and cupcake things. For some reason I don't know why they don't got no ice cream machine here. I'm gonna put one in here. <laughs> Y'all don't think that's all right? That this is an ice cream place? We don't have no damn ice cream machine. Hold on, where's those cups? Is this it? This is it? How do they got the right color? Okay, and then let's get these little pies. Put like a pie right here, and put like a little pie right there. And let's 
not put my right there. Oh, we have cupcakes, the whole cupcake thing. Let's pick them up here. Let's put some cupcakes up here. I don't really care what goes up here. It's not like we want to be like using it anyway. Um, and then let's get a these little bowls that looks like it goes up here. And then it gives me a window. Okay, let's put little bowls up. Is this that one when you got something in it. Okay, perfect. rainbow thing. Okay, perfect. Put some more rainbows around the place. And we'll get those cabinets. I mean, it don't look too bad. <laughs> Uh, I was just trying to keep it like how the person did it that created the shit for real. Alright. And then now let's go ahead and get these cabinets. Okay, so that looks fine. Hopefully they can use the um the station thing though. That's the only thing I'm hoping. Okay, so now that we have the station, now what else do we need? Um, okay, so we have the... Okay, so we have the chef station. We need a waiter station and a host station. Okay. Waiter station. I should have put the chef thing in here though, in that room. But I think I'm gonna put something else in here. Or I could just leave it like that. It don't really matter. Okay, waiter station. Um, so. Why can't I move this? Why can't I move my camera? What the freak up? Okay, great. For waiter station. Um, hmm. I don't want them to be able to come back here at all. Um, but I don't know if I can add any more space right here. Let's see. I don't know if they can even get back here. Hopefully they can in a long time. What a mess. Okay, then we need a host station. Waiter station, host station. Restaurants, 
Um, okay, I'm going to close. Post this station. All this for this damn child's birthday. Post this. Okay, they saying that this is it. Hostess station. What the hell is this? Ah, it's a nuisance. Okay, um. Where does the hostess station go? I think it goes in the front, right? We'll stick it here at the front. I mean, I really don't know. Like, where is it go? Oh, is that where the waiter station goes? <laughs> I don't know. Um, let's just move this coffee because it's like not centered. Yes, this is it. And uh, so we would need to get a big table. I'm about to make a table just for them. Um, these us. And then they have this bed and stuff in here. They do not need this crap in here. I'm about to take this mess out. I need all that. I'm sorry. I use this for a damn table space. I don't need this. Okay, that's like cute decor. Keep those hot chairs. Okay. Well, in case we have like a baby hunger here. We need a table. Um, let's copy this table. Okay, we're going to need something else. We can't use this. Um, let's get another table. Something to kind of look like. This one. We need like a big table for like our family to all sit at. Because it's cherry, um, Miracle, Eric, Yasmin, and um, we might be inviting our uncles and stuff too. So let's go ahead and try to put these two tables together or something. But first, we see if they need even the right color. We'll make them yellow for Marigold's birthday. Um, the only thing I'm worried about now is that we're not going to be able to get from back there. Remotely, even I don't know. Looks like one table was like above the other one, but okay, whatever. Um, let's get some chairs. Jesus. 
like every other chair can be like yellow or something. And then the other ones could be like a cream or a beige. And then I wish they could get like a pinky color. Um, we can do orange or gray. I feel like gray would like downplay this the colorful color scheme here, but whatever. Okay. And then this rug. Make it bigger. Okay. Let's see if we can change the color of it. So like I like a nice yellow so it's perfect. Okay. Let's fix this. But um, she can take our pictures back here. But I need this to be like a yellow wallpaper. Mm. Okay. Um. It's just taking longer than I expected. Okay, let's look up um, balloons. Okay, so we have balloons. This is. So this is like the party section, like when you have your birthdays and shit. Okay, um, what other kind of balloons do we have here? Well, any of the decorations that I can use. That would make this look nicer. Okay, this is way too big. And then that's way too small. Okay, I believe you go Ariel and she can <coughs> age up that. Our little birthday spot. Cute. Okay. And should I put some balloons in the back? Like the um, number of balloons. Let's get the M balloon. Um, we in light. I don't know. Okay, um, I don't know what the balloons are. The 
ones I'm looking for. Decorations. Oh, is it a statue? Okay, so let's get these balloons. And then I wanted the letter ones, but I don't think the tea is on the one. Um, so she'll be turning 16. Um, I'm gonna find it, don't worry. Just need to find them. Oh, it was in plants. And this is going to be the one that she takes home with her. Um, I can't raise it up. Um, can we say like they can't produce a wall? Okay, so it's for Marigold, but it's her stuff. Oh, this is so cute. I kind of want to add some presents now. <laughs> Let's see if we got any gifts. Any presents? Any gifts that we can get her? She can get that. That's like one of her presents over here. And what are bags in here? Oh, um, well, yes. Give her clothes and stuff. Guess. Oh, presents. I think I spelled it wrong. They probably ain't gonna find it. Yeah. Travel presents, large pile of presents, decorative presents, it's just any kind of presents really. I mean, it don't really matter what time. Come on now, presents definitely will come. Yeah, 
bunch of gifts over here. So cute. Come here, Goldie Boy, your presents, girl. All your gifts. Your family really love you. Okay. Shoes, I'm going to go to the girl. Girl, you is lit. <laughs> you is so lit. Somebody brought you those. Okay. Hey, let's get out of here. Um, I guess we can copy some more of these balloons. pretty much okay for her event, her birthday visit, so I'm not really complaining. I feel like it's fine with me, I'm happy with it. We're satisfied. her birthday corner. Let's make sure she got a lot of light over here. We need to be like well lit. Um, get some light lighting. And of course we're gonna get like my favorite lights. These joints. taking her picture this would be so cute okay and this is her birthday table can we add stuff on her table um can we add like this little stuff they got i don't mind adding these things not the table the um the plate thing So they might consider this as two tables, but I'll just have them come in and they get this table too. Finesse the shit out of her little area. Alright, so after this birthday, I'm definitely getting off of here. So. Why do they seem so far apart than the other one? I'll just delete these things, but I would like to possibly send it. Let's just play. 
place I'm going to tell you about. I'll fix them in a minute. Snap into place, jeez. You gotta be all off center and all that extra ness. All right, we ain't making it look perfect because shit, we just this is what being perfect means. Truthfully, I mean, right, what else do they got on these damn tables? Um, we can get the flowers. flowers in here. Oh, let's put the flower like in the middle. Okay, that look fine enough. We don't need all that extra shit that we got on the table, but we gotta still eat our own food. Okay, so this is her birthday spot. Love you on this spot party, and it's gonna look cute. All right, let's see. Oh, it says, Are you sure you want to leave? Your venue is still incomplete. Um, what do you mean? I just got everything on eggs, the chef station, the other station. Jeez, this thing is getting on my nerves already. It says host station. I got that. Okay, let's go to restaurant stuff. I don't know what the fuck the host station is. Restaurant, I guess. Just try to get through it. Uh, so I guess I'm gonna end it. Well, actually, about to end this here, and then when I come back, recording, they will, they will do. Um, oh, we'll have the birthday party and have the baby. Um, let me just go ahead and see really quick. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, you guys, I'm sorry, but I have to stop this recording right now.